Jamwan, the king of the bears. It is a captivating historical figure in Hinduism. This legendary sloth bear was supposedly created by Lord Brahma to help Lord Ram to defeat the demon king Ravan. But that's not all. Jamwan's epic adventures also include being present during Samudra Manthan and clapping in hands with glee while watching Lord Vishnu battle demons. Legends has it that Jamwant was born when Lord Brahma was meditating and yawning. A bear emerged from his yawn. Interestingly, the name Jamwan is derived from either the place he was born, Jambudweep, or from the Sanskrit word of yawn. Though his age is unknown, he is said to have witnessed many historical events, including Vaman's acquisition of the three worlds from Mahabali, which is celebrated by circling around Vishnu seven times. If you are looking to experience the magic of Hinduism, Jamwan is undoubtedly a character to explore. He has many names and his presence added a whole new level of excitement to the Ramayan and other epics. In fact, there's even a city named after him in Ratlam district, Madhya Pradesh, known as Jamthun village or Jamvanta Nagri. Jambhavan, the king of the bears, is said to be one of the immortals or Chiranjeevs. According to scriptures, Jamvan was actually the king of the Himalayas who took birth in the form of a bear to serve Lord Ram. And Lord Ram, in his gratitude, bestowed upon Jamwant a powerful boon. He would have a long life and the might of 10 million lions. But Jamwant's strength weren't limited to physical attributes. He was also incredibly intelligent and quite adept at running a kingdom. As one of Sugriv's advisors, it was Jamwant's who first suggested that Hanuman be sent to Lord Ram and Lakshman when they were wandering in the forest. And when Ma Sita was taken captive by Ravan in Lanka, it was Jamwan and Hanuman who played a key role in her rescue. Jamwan even helped Hanuman realize his true capabilities and encouraged him to leap across the ocean to find Ma Sita. In the Ramayana, Jamwan shared two fascinating stories about his life. Once, when he and Hanuman stood at the base of Mount Mahindra, with Hanuman preparing to make his famous leap over the ocean, Jamwan revealed that he too could have made the jump had it not been for an old injury. This injury was sustained while beating the drum for Lord Vishnu during his Vamana avatar, Lord Vishnu accidentally struck Jamwan's shoulder while measuring the three worlds, causing him to suffer mobility issues that affected him for life. Jamwan's legendary presence in the Ramayana is fascinating. He witnessed the Samudra Manthan and learned about a disease-curing plant called Vishalyakarni from the gods. When Lakshman was severely injured during the battle against Ravan, Jamwan shared his knowledge with Hanuman. The determined Hanuman went on a quest to find the plant, which ultimately revived Lakshman. Jamwan was known for his immense strength and bravery. In a duel with Ravan, he delivered some powerful punches and even kicked him in the chest. This left Ravan unconscious and forced his charioteer to leave the battlefield with him. Despite his age, Jamwan remained a wise and patient character in the Ramayana. Jamwan's legendary exploits weren't just limited to the Ramayana. In fact, he also made a remarkable appearance in the Mahabharata, where he demonstrated his unparalleled strength and cunning. The story goes that Jamwan killed a lion who had stolen a precious gem called Shamantak from Prasena. But little did he know that this would lead him into a fierce fight 
with none other than Lord Krishna himself. The fight lasted for an astounding 18 days, with both sides battling fiercely. However, it wasn't until Jamvan finally recognized Lord Krishna's true identity that he conceded defeat. In recognition of Jamvan's courage and strength, Lord Krishna married his daughter Jamvati and the gem was returned to its rightful owner. Jamvan's remarkable life was filled with incredible feasts and blessings, as he had the good fortune of meeting not just one but two incarnations of Lord Vishnu in his lifetime. It is said that only two others, Parshuram and Hanuman, were blessed with such a remarkable fate. Truly, Jamvan was one of the most remarkable figures of Hinduism. I really appreciate you all tuning in to watch this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to hit that like button, leave a comment and subscribe for more content like this in the future.